guys and welcome back to the Rob Crane 17 channel and today as promised for you guys we have got the Row to Glory episode 1 we're going with Well in Madrid maybe we can go with a different name let me know in the comments below what you feel we should have as our name yes this was our main account last year but going forward we have moved over to luckily PS5 so this is on the Xbox, this was my main account last year, so this year we're going to mix it up, it's going to be a bit more of an RTG and stuff like that, but guys, as I just said, let me know in the comments below who you think we should go with as a team name. Right, as you can see, we have gone with the France team, we didn't mess around, I don't want to show you all the boring stuff and stuff like that, we have got some packs to fly through today, but as I said, you just need to let me know what you feel we should go with as a team name. We've gone with a French thing. What kind of thing can we go with? Because just before we go into it, I do want to finish off this thing quickly. Because it's not looking great in a minute, as you can see. It's not the greatest, but hey, it is episode one. We, When I mean by Road to Glory, I mean by this will be no FIFA points. Everything we do will be earned. No money will go into this game whatsoever. So it's going to be a bit of a challenge for us. And it will run for that the whole entire, entirety of FIFA 22. I'm going to look to upload this every day, but if I don't feel like there's enough information to get over to you guys, I won't be doing so. But without further ado, as I said, as I promised, we do have some packs available for you guys today. We've got two objectives there. I think I did a few of these earlier today, messing around, just waiting for the game to install. What have we got done? What have we got done? What have we got ready? We need to go and pick our team. I think what we do, we stick when we pick the team. We're going to stick with a French theme. We're going to go with a. Uh, I think it's Zidane. Is it Ronaldinho? Icon battles. We're going to try and get involved in these a bit more this year, just so we can get a bit more reward, a bit more stuff going forward. We've got Kaka, Hullet, Zidane. We're going to go with Zidane for now. Reason being, we've got that French theme, it should be easier to contribute to it because we have got the French team. And I can imagine a lot of people have gone for the French theme this year. It is easier to think, link up in SBCs going forward and stuff like that. We've all been there, we spoke about it enough times. So, let's have a look what we've got. We've got basics in here that we need to claim. We're going to try and claim absolute everything, try not to be lazy this year because last year was quite lazy when it comes to things. But we do get a gold reward pack for this, so... This will lead up to the pack opening. Just for episode one, it's something good. It's something we can enjoy. It's something we can all relate to going forward. We have got the SBC thing. It is nothing there really to take. Don't know, guys, how you feel about this, but let me know in the comments below. I feel like the menus are very slow. I don't feel like they're very speedy at all. I know I'm on the old gen with this Xbox, but I still feel like they're very slow. Is that just because of me being selfish? Because I'm coming from PS5 down to Xbox. Let me know. Let me know what you think. But I think we've got about 9 or 10 packs to open up on this account. 9. Right, if you're wondering where these packs have come from, these are the welcome backpacks. They're nothing too special. Like, for instance, one of them is a stadium pack. I think you've got a two players pack from the SBCs we've done earlier and the foundations and stuff like that. Please do go head over to there and hand them out as quick as you can because... They're just easy packs to do. They are absolute easy things to do. They simply just put in bronze keepers in and stuff like that. And you do get a few decent rewards and you're guaranteed to make profit every single time. There is no way on this earth you cannot make a profit from it. So that's quite a simple way forward. Do we have any other little silly reward packs going forward? No, we don't. Right, we're going to open up the first gold pack. The first pack on the RTG series. Can we pack anything good from this? Come on, boys. It's going to be a non-rare, it's going to be a Chilean goalkeeper, it's going to be Bravo. Bravo, what a great start that is. It's not bad, a Chilean goalkeeper from Real Betes. We'll take it, we'll take it, we'll take everything at this point. I'm not sure if these packs are tradable or not, I expect them to be. They are, they are tradable, so that is quite massive for us. We're going to take everything, obviously there's nothing in there in a minute, but by the end of this episode I want to be able to build a team, put a team together for you guys, just to see what's going on and stuff like that. Right, pack number two is another non-rare. Spain, left back. It's not someone we're going to use. Jamu Costa. And yet again, it's not something we're going to use, but we keep saying it. We'll take the coins. We will take the coins. Fingers crossed we can get this half-decent pull. We do get a Premier League player. Pratt has gone across to Trino. It's a good move for him, to be fair. Good luck to the boy. Right, we've still got six left. This is the gold reward pack. You don't get nothing, no rares from this, so we're not expecting anything in particular. 
if anything, it'd just be a few coins from the items. There we go. Z Louise. Nothing special at all. But hey, as we said, it all goes in. It all goes towards something. It all goes towards the future of this club. Let me know in the comments below if you guys are doing a road to glory as well. I'll be quite interested to see how you do and how you've got started off. Right. We're going to start off with the two gold rare players. Fingers crossed we can get something from this. I don't think... Yeah, I think you get, can get a silver from this as well. Right. We do get the gold. It's going to be... Okay. It's not great, but... Beep boop, as the Pemphez would say, it's not a bad pack. You know what I mean? That striker, he will be half decent for us. Maybe for a starter team with a Bundesliga for 90 pace, that isn't that probably a great pull for us, somewhere to start. But hey, this is what we're all here for the four starter packs. The absolutely fantastic start we can get from these would be absolutely unbelievable. Let's start off with number three. For some reason, I've got a funny feeling about number three, but hey, come on, let's go. Fingers crossed we can get something. Quite amazing from this. Right, what do we get? Just the boards. Nothing special. Oh, typical. Paco. We get Paco. No doubt we're going to get loads of Pacos from these pack openings in the future. We do get a, a Harvey a Harvey Barnes, which is not too bad. We're only getting one gold player from this, but they are 80 and above rated, which is not too bad. It's a good thing to help just flood the, uh, flood the cub with. Get stuff going. Just pack things out. Right. Gold players pack number two. Come on. Can we get something higher? Any red flare? No. Spain goalkeeper is going to be Lopez. Again, I hate seeing Spanish. Anything over doing this game, I hate seeing the Spanish flag. It's just never any good. But hey, what can we do about that? There's nothing we can do. Right, I think you only get one rare from these, which is not great. Remember back in the day, you used to get better packs and stuff like that, but... Let's go. Come on. Can we get something better? We do. We get a red flare. We don't get walkout. A Mexican striker. Hey, it's going to be Real Jimenez. It's just not bad. 83 rated from the Premier League. <sighs> it's leaving me. I'm not too sure I want to go with a squad at the minute. This is going to be pretty... Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, boys. Let me know in the comments what you think below. But I've already built a team in that time. But hey, without further ado, we're in this last pack. Fingers crossed we can get something big from this. Please. Where's the red flare? It's not going to be a walkout. Mexican. Carlos Vela. Maybe we are looking at a Mexican theme. Who knows? I'm not too sure. I probably won't go down that route. I probably will sell these players on. But you never know. You just never know. We've got quite a few Lala in there. We could go with a French team. I think that's what we're going to do. We're going to head straight over. We're going to head straight in. And tell you what we will do. We will open up our preview pack before we go and build our squad. Because fingers crossed we can get something good for this. Right. There's the gold packs. It's let me preview one of them. Okay, it's not too bad. It's the higher pack. I'm sure we can make enough coins if it is any good. Right, it's going to be a non-rare. It's not even worth looking at. A left back. 82 rated bear that. It's actually not that too bad, but it's not what we're looking for. It really, really is not what we're looking for. A Bielsa in there as well as manager won't be too bad. But as I said, without further ado now, we're going to push over to start building the team. Something you guys can relate to, because impacts weren't great, we're not too far. So what I'm going to do, we're probably going to have to stick with a f goalkeeper for now. It's mainly the back line. The back line is absolutely terrible. We might have to just stick with that French theme. I'm not too sure. What we do, we'll pull them all out. I'll tell you what we do. We'll go to squad selector. We're going to start a new squad. This is what you want to do, really. Instead of moving them all out, then you can go and have a look at what you're doing. This is where I'll put my team name for you guys for now. We're just putting anything. If anything, we'll just stick to RTG, so it's not too complicated and not too bad. Right, goalkeeper-wise, we didn't really pack anything fantastic. Uh, have we got, a, we got, we got a Premier League goalkeeper in there? Well, we're going to hold on to that for now. Let's see if we've got anything else in there at the back. Could go with Johnny Evans, which is not great, but one thing I did see and I was quite happy with. What we're going to do, we're going to take the Premier League guy out. We're going to go with a French theme at the back. I know we did have a French theme to start with. Didn't really need to move our squad around, but do we have that French goalkeeper? We don't. That's the problem. So, what we will do, McCarthy will go back in. Just means now we will have to use a centre back. Could go with him, but just for chemistry reasons, we're going to take Evans out, and we are going to go with Everton to Holgate. Right, I know this is not the greatest Premier League starter team, but fingers crossed we can go through something else going forward. I think in the next episode we might even build a build a bit more we'll upgrade it we're going to go with Bernie's record signing Cornet which is not too bad what about on the right hand side can we get the French guys some chem I don't think we will be able to we will get a little bit Kenny Lala it's not too bad they've only been on 7 chem anyway 
Let's move on to the right hand side. I don't think we're going to go with 4 4 2 going forward, but it seems easy just to build a team around it. We're going to go 67 midfield. It's not great, but it puts Lalo on full cam, which is absolutely fantastic. Of course, we've got to go with Harvey Barnes. We've got Son on loan, but at the minute, we're going to have him for three games. So I think we'll save him for the big games and the rivals games, maybe, and stuff like that. We're going to go with Kapoe in the middle. He's going to go and cross and help the thing out. We're now going to search the other side of the centre mid, but one thing you can do as well, obviously, if you are new to the game, you can just go midfielder and it'll come up all the midfielders. We kind of want to link it into the Premier League. It's not looking great. We're going to have to go maybe Trezeguet in the midfield. It's, again, it's not ideal, but who knows? Who knows what we could do at the end of it? Uh, we're in a bit of trouble here, boys. We are in absolute bother. What we're going to do, we're going to leave it for now. Check the centre mids in general because... Nothing we can really do. I see what we do. We're probably going to have to go with that bronze guy for now. But that's probably someone we can buy someone. We can put someone else in there. It wouldn't be too bad. But we're going to put the bronze in just for a bit. Kem, if I swing him over, I should pot. Doesn't put half centre back on full Kem. But hey, never mind. Going forward, I know I've got a terrific French die car in Lacazette. When I mean terrific, a bit tongue-in-cheek. It's not the greatest. But for the squad, he is going to be our best player. We do have thing on loan, but I did say we could use Badu. But I tell you what, Badu will come off the bench because that's probably one of the better ways we can do it. Uh, do we have any more French? Any more French strikers? I think it's going to have to be Modest, which is not too bad because it will get a bit of chem going thing. But then you realise they got relegated, so that's probably not the bestest example. There we go. We're all learning. We're all learning. We're all remembering. But that's the squad we're going to go with. We have got 98 chemistry. If we put any type of manager in, I think we are, did ask for a French thing. There's no manager in there whatsoever that's French. Have we got a manager in general? No one's going to help. We're going to go with Gary Baldy. State of the bloke. He's got a suit on. I don't know why. don't even know why he's in the game. But hey, that is going to be our starter team going forward for the RTG. On tomorrow's episode, we will have added a bit more to it. Fingers crossed we will have a decent, maybe a decent French team just in general. But hey, who knows? Guys, let me know in the comments below what you think we should do with this team, and what you did with your team. Guys, this has been the end of episode 1. Hope you've enjoyed it. Make sure you smash that subscribe button so you don't miss any more. And boys, peace.